Rebels. First of all, before I get started with this video, I wanted to mention that I got new lighting for my videos. How awesome is this? I'm not orange anymore. So, okay, the story with the lighting, I'm going to go into that first. So, I went to Walmart and I actually got paid from doing a photography job, so that's where I got the money. But I wanted to get new desk lamps or new lighting for all of my videos and everything because I was tired of being orange and looking orange on film and it just, it was not pretty. It was not cool for me. So, I actually went to Walmart and I was planning on getting two desk lamps and I actually got, um, or I was planning on getting two for about $20, you know, $10 a piece, which, you know, that's kind of normal. And so my boyfriend took me and we were walking down the aisle and I saw a sign that said that these desk lamps were only $4 each. So I was like, okay, that's a freaking bonus. So I got them and then I went to go find the light bulbs for them and they're just 40 watt light bulbs or whatever. And I got four light bulbs for $4 because they're not the frosted ones, they're just the clear ones. And so after I had gotten the the, um, the light bulbs we went to go check out and everything because I got a couple other items as well. Another item that I actually got, I have to show this in this video real quick. I got these cups at Walmart. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know that I have these or on Facebook or Twitter because I probably posted it on there too. But I got these little cups. How cute are these? These were in the birthday party section and they were with all the other birthday party cups and everything. And they're not just the flimsy throwaway ones. They're they're plastic, so you can reuse them. And I thought they were so perfect for me because they're pink and Hello Kitty and Barbie. My two favorite, three favorite things. Pink, Hello Kitty, and Barbie. So, yep, they're so super cute and I love them so much. And they were only 87 cents each, if you were wondering. I don't know if I already mentioned that or not. Anyway, so I was checking out and the lamps rung up as $2.50 a piece. So it was only $5 for two lamps and then I got the uh, light bulbs for $4. So it was $9 and I was planning on spending 20 So it was freaking awesome. It was so cool. So let me know what you think of this lighting. I think it's like a zillion times better. I might not even have to like edit my videos with the YouTube editor now. I could probably just post it and leave it. Anyway, okay, so the main reason behind this video or the purpose of this video is Bath and Body Works. Okay, so like I said, I got paid from doing a photography gig, so I had a little bit of money. And in my influencer uh, beauty blogger, beauty bloggers Vox Box, I got a ten dollar coupon that said um, any three wick candle ten dollars up to um, a five candle limit. So I was so excited. I was not about to pay $20 for a candle and regardless, yeah, I think $10 for a candle is like like ridiculous, but I actually am starting to be in love with candles. I am obsessed with candles. The one that I got in my Influencer um, Vox box is the Pumpkin Cupcake, and I actually didn't see this one when I went to Bath and Body Works, but you can see obviously how much I like it, like how much is gone. It's like half gone already, see? And I just got my Vox box like I think I got my Vox box on Friday? I think it was Friday or Saturday that I got my Vox box. So yeah, this is like, it smells so good. Pumpkin cupcake. I love pumpkin cupcake. Thumbs up for that one. But um, I wanted to go, I was wondering if it was just for fall candles, but it wasn't. I, I went in there and I asked the lady, she's like, I've never seen this coupon before, so apparently I'm the only one where I live that gets influenced, which is kind of cool. But um, she's like, I've never seen this coupon before. Um, I guess you're more than welcome to choose any candle, I'm assuming. So um, my sister actually takes me to the library every week, and she just drives me around some places sometimes. So I I thought it was highly appropriate to kind of, you know, give back to her a little bit. So I took some of the money and I took, you know, $20 and I said, okay, if you drive me up there, you know, I'll get you a candle because I kind of owe you and, you know, they're only $10. I mean, I say only loosely because they're the giant three-wick candles. So anyway, we went up there today and oh, I got a candle and this isn't like a haul or anything. That's why I put haul in quotes because it's only one candle. So it's like whoopity doo. But um, anyway. Moving on, I did get a lot of coupons though, and I'm actually going to show share those with you right now, and then I'll get into which candles we got. So the first coupon that's in here is our gift to you, a free item of your choice with any $15 purchase, and it can be um, up to $13 worth of whatever. So you can buy, you know, a small candle that's like $10 or something, and um, or you can buy what what was it? 
Maybe, maybe you can buy like a sale item or something. I don't know what's $15. Maybe you spend like, maybe you get two small candles. What if you get two small candles and then you get like a free item so you can pick anything up to $13. So you could pick another candle or you could pick a, a body spray or whatever have you that you want. But anyway, so yeah, that's pretty cool. And then I actually got this coupon book this coupon book. It actually has three coupons in the front. I guess it's not really a coupon book when there's only three coupons, but anyway, so it, there's another one of those buy one, get one free, and that's on here, and I don't think there's a promo code or anything. Oh, there's an online code. If you guys want the online codes for this, I'll post it below, and then you can have the online code. This one, this coupon right here is valid. Uh, from October 29th, so it's not valid quite yet, but it will be next week, through November 25th. So I'll give you the online code. I'll put it in the description box below. And um, you can use the coupon code for the uh, buy one, get one, uh, your choice or whatever. And then I also have another one that I think, actually let me take this off of here, that has the promo code for online. Yep, this one and... They're two separate codes, so I will put both of those for the buy one, get one, um, free item of your choice or whatever. I will put both of those in the description box. And then I also got to 10% um, off any purchase of $30 or more now through um, November 19th through December 9th, right there. And I believe that this one has an online coupon code, and if you want me to, I can post it below. I'm just going to rip it off of here. Yep, this one has an online code as well, so I can... Oh, sorry, my camera is not focusing. There we go. Okay, so I can very well post that below if you wish. And then I also got save 20% off your entire purchase. So no matter what you buy, you get 20% off. And that is epic. And I also have a coupon code for that. So if you want me to post them all in the description box, just let me know that you're interested. And I will post them. Otherwise, I'm not going to post them probably. Um, just just let me know if you want them and I'll give them to you and you can use them online. But um, yeah, I don't think you can use them in the store. I don't think you can use the code in the store. You have to literally show them the coupons. So yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Anyways, moving on. Okay. So yeah, to the candles. I'm sorry that this is such a long intro. To the candles. Okay. My, okay. I wanted to go and I wanted to smell every single candle that they had in the store. And I did just that. And they had some crazy candles in there, you guys. I, you guys have probably already been there. I'm probably just slow. You know, I got warped into the YouTube hype about Bath and Body Works candles and everything for the fall and the, the seasonal times of year. And so I actually went in there and I smelled, like I said, I smelled every single candle and there are some in there that I love, love, love. And there's some in there that I dis... Oh, it's disgusting. So, um, like there were some that I would literally was just like, uh, who would buy that? Like, what's the point? So I went in there cause I had gotten online and I went in there and like I said before, it didn't matter if you got fall or, um, it, it was any candle. It didn't just have to be the fall seasons or the fall season. So I got online and I saw one and it was sweet macaroon or something like that. And it was macaroon and it was so pretty. Like the the jar was just all like pretty like it was so so pretty and I was like oh that's gorgeous I really hope I like that smell so I go in there and I'm smelling all these other candles and I'm just like you know what I don't even see the macaroon one in here it's not even in here and then I'm going up to go um like go look at something else like the hand sanitizers and soaps and stuff and then I turn around and I was like oh my gosh there's the macaroon one I have to go smell it so I smelled it and I literally it was revolting. Like, it was so gross smelling. I didn't like it. I don't know. It may just be my sense of smell. Everyone has a different sense of smell, in my opinion. So, I didn't really like it. That's just my opinion. But there were actually two, maybe three candles that I fell in love with. But another one I have to mention that was kind of revolting was the um, the Thanksgiving candle. If you guys haven't smelled the Thanksgiving candle, it, no joke, smells like a Thanksgiving dinner. It smells like turkey and mashed potatoes and gravy. So if you want your house to smell like you just cooked Thanksgiving or Christmas dinner and it's potatoes and green beans and casseroles and stuffing and turkey, that would be the candle to buy. I thought it was really cool that it smelled like, you know, potatoes and gravy, but then again, it's like, I don't want my room smelling like potatoes and gravy all the time. So and the fact that it was a big candle, so it would last me a long time. I didn't think that that was appropriate. So, my sister 
was debating between Tis the Season, which was kind of like a cinnamon spicy one, and then she was also debating between um, vanilla cupcake, or no, frosted cupcake and vanilla snowflake. And she's always been more of the vanilla-y type person. She always likes the like vanilla scents better, like the, the sweets and everything like that, like the baked goods, and she just loves those. And she has the autumn candle already, and she loves, loves, loves it. It's like her favorite candle of all time. So, I figured that I would try to smell autumn, but they didn't have autumn, and I smelled leaves, and I smelled, um, what is that other one? I can't remember. Uh, mahogany and teak wood, or whatever it is. Um, I smelled those, and yeah, I don't like that smell, really, so I'm not a huge fan of Abercrombie. They say it smells like Abercrombie, but it smells a little bit better than Abercrombie, in my opinion, because I can't stand Abercrombie. I don't know. I just don't like the preppy smells like that. I don't know. But, um, anyway. So, I got the perfect candle for me, and I got the perfect candle for my sister. My sister actually finally decided on Vanilla Snowflake. So, that's the one that she got. It was just like a vanilla s candle, pretty much. It just smelled like vanilla mixed with a little bit of... It did. It kind of smelled like snow, which was weird. It was, like, nice and crisp. Anyway, now I'll get into the one that I got. I actually picked up this is not a common one. I didn't even know they had this one. I had not seen this one on YouTube or anything. But I got Fireside. And it looks like this. And it's just really cute and pretty. And then it's got the little Bath and Body Works logo on it that you guys probably already know. But um, on the bottom of this one, it says, A cozy blend of cedar wood, leather, and rich, deep amber that warms your spirits like an evening by a crackling fire on a dark winter's night. I love campfires. And I'm miss going camping and I just oh I I smelled this and I smelled it and at first I didn't like it like I smelled it and I was like ew that's kind of gross smelling but then I went back to it like I, after I smelled everything I went back to it and I was debating between this one and I believe it was frosted cranberry or vanilla cranberry or something like that it was a cranberry one and it smelled so 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 good but I was like you know what I already have a lot of fruity candles well I actually have one two three four I have four candles all together right now but um inc including this one is five but I was like you know what no I came to Bath and Body Works I'm gonna spend ten dollars on a candle I want to get something special I want to get something that no one else has that, like, no one is close to like it. And I actually went to Walmart the night before with my boyfriend, like I said, and I smelled every single candle they had there. I smelled the limited edition ones that people have recommended to me. Um, I was going to get the marshmallow s'more one, and it smelled so yummy. But then again, it's just like I was smelling all of them, and I was like, you know what, these don't really smell like great. You know, granted, they'll probably smell better once they're lit, but I don't know, I just wasn't really into it. So I got this one, and this one... Smells like a mixture between burnt wood, smoke, and mince cologne. And it's just, it's so nice. Like, I don't know. I like it. You guys would probably smell it and be like, ugh, what is that? But I smell it and I'm like, oh, it smells so yummy to me. I just, I love it. I can't, I can't get enough of it. I don't know why. And it's cool because my boyfriend's in my room most of the time when he comes over. Like, we'll watch a movie. And so, I wanted it to smell like... I don't want to get, like, a froofy candle, if you know what I mean. I didn't want him to come in here and be like, why does it smell like roses or something? Like, he doesn't really like that. So, I figured that this was a nice masculine candle. It's a nice masculine smelling candle. And I actually, uh, my, my room is in the basement of my house, and we have a wood stove, and we burn, uh, uh, we burn wood during the winter to help keep us warm because we don't have like a heating system in our house so we just use the wood stove and I thought that it would be perfect because the wood stove is always closed so I can't really smell the crisp fire and you know I, I miss going camping in the woods and everything like that so I figured you know what while I'm getting all toasty and warm with my hot cocoa wrapped up in a blanket watching a movie or something and I'm just sitting next to the fireplace or something, I can, or the, the wood stove, it's not a fireplace, it's a wood stove, I can light this baby up and it will smell just like I'm camping in the middle of the forest. So I am so excited to burn this. I have not burnt it yet and I will definitely keep you guys up to date on how I like it. And I just, oh, I'm so, thank you, thank you so much, Influencer, for including that. That's that for this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you guys get a chance, please smell this candle. And if you've already smelled it, let me know what you think. And yeah, that's that. If you want the coupon codes, comment below. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye. I don't know if you guys will like it. Like I said, everyone's smell is different. So everyone has a different sniffer.